think this is a great opportunity for us to understand how the movie industry works, how a movie festival works, which are the responsibility of a jury member, and I think it's a really great opportunity to get a closer look at the movie industry in Italy and, uh, and outside Italy. It feels weird uh, because you know that you have a uh, great responsibility and even if it's not uh, the biggest jury of uh, this festival, it's still uh, pretty cool to be here and to take part of such an important uh, festival and uh, jury at the same time. Great opportunity to be a part of the student jury for UNIMED, which is I find like really really cool, and it's giving us such more opportunities for future. Uh, actually, like I added in in my CV, and I already had like some calls when people like were mentioned so, like, how it's important and how cool is it to be uh, in Venice as a jury. So I'm really appreciate the experience. It's a great honor to stay in Venice for the first time. Uh, thank you for uh, Juria Unimed. I study cinema and for me it's an honor being here and like a jury of the Biennale. Excited and nervous um, to be here and to meet all of the other jury members. And I was glad we managed to watch a movie on the first night here. And I'm excited for the following days. Il premio Unimed è un premio, come ben sapete, dell'Università del Mediterraneo. I have also voted for uh, Estate a Mano di Dio because I think that's the most emotional movie that I've watched in this competition. At this point, uh, I would like to uh, um, ask the jury, uh, if they don't mind, uh, to come everybody here. I empathize a lot with the characters and so I like it so much. It's so emotional to me. That's it. <laughs> it's uh, è stata la mano di Dio by Paolo Sorrentino. I actually didn't know that it's a story of Sorrentino's life. So when I found it out, it's actually even made more sense and make me like feel more. At the end, we were evaluating films from an artistic and cultural point of view. So that we were genderly equal, let's say, in our opinions as well. Uh, I learned so many things about uh, Italian family life and uh, some struggles that uh, people face uh, in the south of Italy. Um, go for the movie that was mostly emotional for every one of us, in which every one of us could see a little bit of himself and also spoke about maybe in a way cultural diversity because some of our students from the jury are actually from a different culture and it was interesting to um, see the way they saw a movie that was mainly uh, permeated with our own culture, Italian culture. It had so many uh, on the spot reflections also on the uh, history of the country, uh, the, what people uh, what people uh, give uh, importance, like uh, Maradona and how they uh, sports, uh, how the other uh, um, elements uh, in the daily routine of uh, Italians. This movie is a tender and intimate tale about the sparkle that lights life up, about overcoming difficulties and hiding weaknesses. Bye, thank you, Unimed. Uh, oh, bye. Thank yes, you. we have to. <laughs> thank thanks, you. Unimed. Uh, thank you, thank Unimed. Auguri. <laughs> Complimenti. Yeah, so thank you, Unimed. Thank you. Grazie mille. Ciao.